nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition, lift off. We will be passing through max Q. Falcon 9 is supersonic. That is the maximum aerodynamic pressure that the vehicle will see, which is the largest structural load that the vehicle sees throughout ascent. Now coming up in about a minute, we will have three events happening back to back. First is main engine cutoff, or MECO. MECO. Stage separation confirmed. Successful MECO. Successful stage step. And it appears we have reignited, or ignited, that second stage engine for SES-1. And there we are. We're going through the thickest portion of the atmosphere at the highest speeds. Now, as we continue to accelerate Falcon 9, the air density gets thinner and the loads on the vehicle decrease. And right down the middle, Falcon 9 has landed. Uh, this particular booster has landed for the sixth time. This marks our 62nd successful recovery of a Falcon 9 first stage. And the 32nd time we've landed on this particular drone ship, uh, of course, I still love you. Three, two. And we have lift off. Stage one propulsion nominal. Vehicle's pitching down range. And we are throttling down the vehicle, uh, the engines in preparation for max Q or maximum aerodynamic pressure. Max Q. And there we heard the call out for Max Q. So there are both shots that we have on screen um, are actually both of the, of the second stage. We can see the large plume on the left hand side. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition and lift off. Let's go, Socket, for number 10. And there you can see on your left hand screen that landing burn has begun. So let's see if we can land the first stage for a 12th time. Waiting for confirmation of first stage touchdown. And there you can see it on your screen. Falcon 9 has touched down for this booster's 12th time. This marks our 104th successful recovery of a Falcon 9 first stage.